Mm, in need of a win, I think. Thanks for that, Nisha. Now, if you like those TV programmes that show off beautifully designed homes, you'd be interested to know several in our region are in the running for Building of the Year. That's in the Royal Institute of British Architects Awards for 2022. Yep, that's right. One from our patch will go forward to the national final in a few months' time. So which one could it be? Jerry Jackson's been looking at a couple of the contenders. There was a time when winning a prize for your home design was all about making it eye-catching. These days, to catch a judge's eye, it also has to be green, efficient and sustainable. Just outside Lanchester in County Durham is Shepherd's Barn. The Shepherds are Paul and Sonny. The barn is their refurbishment project. Not so much a labour of love, but part of a low-carbon lifestyle. It's airtight sealed. The home is powered by a combination of solar panels and heat transfer from the soil. And once in, very little of that heat is allowed to escape. Total energy costs are about £500 a year for the whole house. It's a little bit more expensive, about 10% extra cost up front. But if you think about the long-term savings, they are vast. It's so comfortable because there's no drafts around your ankles when you're sitting here at night or anything like that. Um, and it's a really pleasant temperature the whole, whole time. So it's a super place to live. The couple even sell excess electricity back to the national grid. The shepherds keep bees and tend a community orchard. They say this is their forever home. Other contenders are the refurbished Newcastle Civic Centre, the restored Seton Deleville Hall and the zinc and timber clad North Bank property near Hayden Bridge. The North East winner will be announced next month and will go forward to the Royal Institute of British Architects final later in the year. Jerry Jackson. BBC Look North. Wow, they were fab, weren't they? Beautiful. Absolutely super.